Welcome to my reaction to Season 2, Episode 5 of Sangatsu no Lion. Last time we learned about Hinata being bullied and Rei is trying to figure out what he can do about it, and I sure hope he figures something out, and we can put those little bitches in their places. Fuck them. Let's see what happens. Let's get into it in 3, 2, 1, play. Because that was a very upsetting episode to watch. That was harsh. So, uh, I don't, I don't know, maybe this one will be a little lighter. I won't have to be in tears the whole time. I don't mind, though. But yeah, as usual, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy these videos. Sangatsu comes out on Fridays, and you can get the videos early before they go up on YouTube on my Patreon. And you can also see other videos that I make on my other channel, if you want to check that stuff out. That is linked down below. And, uh, thank you. I appreciate it. I'm going to like this opening a lot more. I liked it from the beginning, but I've gotten more into it as it's gone on. All the openings and en endings are good. All right, let's see. Continuing feelings. Oh boy. <laughs> More feelings. All right, go to the teacher. That's a strong, that's a strong move. Let's stop bullying. He's like, no, it's not me, it's my friend. But I, you never believe someone when they tell you that. Although, what do you, what do you do? What is an anti-bullying measure? What do you, how do you do it? How do you just stop people from being jerks? That's just a thing people do. There's no one who even notices me enough to bully me, so it's fine. Don't worry about it. Yeah, she did have the one nice person. Imagine if she hadn't been there. Oh yeah, that could have gone in the direction that I thought it was going to go. Yeah, and the teacher was a bit of a bitch. She's not paying attention, didn't care enough. I don't know what her deal was. Just didn't want to have to deal with it. Didn't want to have to deal with that kind of conflict in her classroom and... Just pretend it's not happening. That's a lot. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not that simple. It's complex. Uh-huh.
So what do we do? I don't. I don't need to know how to stop bullying uh, it forever in every form. Just what do we do about this situation right here? What is the unique answer for this scenario? <clears throat> Oh yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot of moving parts, a lot of people involved, a lot of motivations, a lot of complicated feelings. It's rough. That's no good. Okay. He's so lucky to have this teacher, even if he's not his teacher anymore. Oh my god. <laughs> Listen, your daughter's obviously a piece of shit and she should be put to death. Is she meant to look like Kyoko? Uh, yeah, you can do so many things that could end up causing more problems. But also, the kids won't always know what's best for them. Okay, you have the types of bullies who will, like, stop if they get no reaction out of you because they just want a reaction. I guess there's the type where they'll stop if you stand up to them. She's Hanakana. He's going to be like, oh no, are you in love with this middle school student? No, sir. <clears throat> but don't even get me started on her hot sister. Akari, I mean. So we're not, so we're clear on that. Oh no. You're 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 going even further down the rabbit hole. <clears throat> yes. He's not picking up on on what he's trying to get at at all. They're on completely different pages. <laughs> wow, he went right into that as hard as you possibly could, and he's not picking up on his feelings, his reactions, so he's not going to be able to correct him. <laughs> so he's just going to go on thinking that this is a, a romantic thing. Oh my god, wow, that could not have played out <laughs> worse if he tried.
He's like, listen, I'm a teacher. I make no money. Nice. Well, he's like, well, I gotta quit being a teacher and I gotta become a pro shogi player. Oh, yeah. No more losing. Thank you very much, Sensei. <clears throat> it's not that serious, dude. <laughs> With calculator in hand. <laughs> Okay, I will stay tuned. Calculator in hand. Confession! Oh no! Oh yeah, his, his his spirit is burning passionately. Shit. So did he really just say, I can't afford to lose anymore, and then go lose immediately? <laughs> that sucks. But my god, he is very serious about how much he thinks he owes her, and how far he's willing to go for her. He's thinking very far ahead into very extreme situations that require good amounts of money. <laughs> I mean, at least he's serious. I think he's being a little extreme, but at least he's serious. It's a little much, but he cares, and he knows that he needs money for it, and so he wants to do whatever it takes to get it. <clears throat> All for that money. Best friends, best friends, money, money, money. <laughs> Help out with some of the some of the heavy lifting. That's nice. Well, you gotta take advantage of the sales. Good for you. Oh, that's cool. Go have some fun. Yeah. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Adorable. He's fine. He's strong. He moves those shogi pieces around so much, his arm muscles are fucking...
bursting out of his sleeves as we speak. Fluffy like Nikaido. All right. What is 52 kilograms in pounds? 114 pounds. Yeah, that's... What the fuck? How tall is he? I don't know how tall he is, but that's real fucking... What the fuck? God damn. Eat. Eat. Eat food. Oh my god. Yeah. I mean, even if you want to... I, I loved what he was telling her, like, how she did the right thing and reassured her. But also, you don't want to see her going through that pain. Nice. I mean, that's fair to have those thoughts. Like, you could have told me there are other things you could have done and... Just wanting wanting it to be better for her, so understanding that there might be better things she may have been able to do, and being frustrated by it. But yes, yeah, she did not do anything wrong. Yeah, that's true. What a nice guy. There's so many characters in this show that it's just like... They don't exist. Because they're fictional characters. But it's like... It's great to think that they exist. At least in this world. It's good to know that they exist. And it makes you want to think that people like that really exist. Like Ray's teacher, and the grandpa, and Akari, and even Hinata, and Nikaido. All these people who are just so supportive, especially to Ray, because we see how much Ray goes through and how helpful it is for them to be around. That it makes you want to have people like that around in real life. Don't blame yourself. Yeah, I mean, that's an understandable thought to have. To kind of selfishly think about her over these other kids. See, look at this. It affects, it even affects her. It's not simple.
Yeah. You're my savior too. Now I gotta save up a bunch of money to help you out. What? What is that? Is that like Pikachu? <laughs> oh my god, she's so excited. No, 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 it's fine. No, stay, stay, please. Yes, thank you. Look at that! It's a little cat ray. Kitayama. Alright, so this show has the best music of any anime of all time. It also has some of the best characters. It also has some of the best visuals. That's pretty good. It also has the best shogi. I'll give it that too. <laughs> that one's not as important, but it there it is. It has some of the best OPs and EDs. Pretty good. Ray, you should probably put on some weight. Just a little. So I'm glad we're continuing focusing on this situation and acknowledging how complex it is. And we're still dealing with feelings. Not as strong, but they're still there. I don't think, if I rewatch this show, I don't think I would ever skip the openings or the endings, ever. Because they fit so perfectly. Like, the opening just sets the tone immediately. It's like, you listen to the opening and it just gets you in the mood to watch Sangatsu. And then the ED is just a nice little calming thing afterwards. So I, I don't think I would ever skip them. And that's pretty rare. But yeah, thank you for watching. Leave your thoughts in the comments. See you next time.